Hello everybody, uh, welcome back to another video on my channel. Um, I am not doing a voiceover in this video as you would have hoped probably worked out in the last video um, because I have a bit of a quiet house at the moment so I thought I'd do a bit of um, recording as it is. Um, so this is predominantly Black Friday buys. Um, a couple of things from D stashes which were prior to Black Friday or nothing to do with Black Friday. Um, and a couple of bits that have come in recently that again weren't anything to do with Black Friday so I'll tell you if I used a code or not um, I'll tell you if it is Black Friday uh, I know some of them just off the top are definitely Black Friday because they have the um, kind of bags of extra freebies which is really cool so I'll probably end up having doubles of freebies um, which I don't mind because some stickers I quite like having a couple of um, and then it also reminds me to go to the shop and buy that sticker sheet if there is a sticker that I like the look of. Um, so yeah, I will split this video um, into sections. Um, I'll try and make it as short as possible and I will do D-Stash stuff first and then shop stuff and then Black Friday stuff. So here is everything that you see here. Obviously I've blocked out my address. A um, couple of disclaimers before we start. Um, before any questions are asked, all of this is bought with my own money. I do work very hard in my family business and this is what I treat myself to. <laughs> um, and secondly, yes, my nails are horrendously grown out with the uh, extra bit of nail there. Um, I've actually been trying out some stuff on my own nails. Um, I am a nail tech, so I've been testing out some stuff in readiness for when I eventually go back to doing nails. Um, I'm not doing clients at the moment, so hence not so good looking nails but these have been on for five weeks or nearly six weeks six weeks i think um so they are lasting quite a while so you've seen these in a few videos now or by now you would have seen these in a few videos i'm going to stop rambling i'm going to put things into piles take things out of cello bags so you don't hear the horrible noise some people like it i certainly don't um and yeah we'll get started Okay, so I'm starting off with two bits from uh, a D stash or from separate D stashes. Um, can't remember off the top of my head which uh, Facebook group they are from. Sorry, I said I was going to take the cello wrapper off of this, um, <clears throat> but I have now. Um, so yep, yeah, so these are from D stashes, two separate ones, I believe. Um, in fact, I'm certain that they were two separate ones, um, one of which was selling washi. So I picked up some washi um, and the other of which was selling kits. Both of these shops that they are are not UK shops. Um, so yeah, I'll explain as I go. So this one was a very small de-stash. They were de-stashing some unused washi tape from Simply Gilded. This is actually my first Simply Gilded haul ever because I am a bit nervous to order from shops that are overseas. The only shop I do order from is Prairie Planner because um, they're in Cam Canada and the shipping is um, reasonable and there's no customs that I have to pay. Um, so these were the two rolls that I got. Um, don't question me on the uh, size. I don't know how the sizes work, but they're the same roll. And I've got the smaller one and the larger one. Um, and they've not been unwrapped or anything, so that's cool. And then this was a D-stash that actually came in very, very recently. Let me make sure I've got everything out of the envelope. Throw that off to the side. Okay, so... Um, it was actually a kit de-stash, um, so someone was de-stashing kits that they just hadn't used, um, and all of these kits are Simply Gilded, which is, uh, Simply Gilded, Scribble Prints Co., which is really awesome. Um, I've not really had kits from Scribble Prints Co., I think, uh, in one of the first or second weeks that I planned in the planner that I've got so I started planning properly in March like memory planning um two of the kits there were from sim uh, well, I keep saying simply gilded scribble prints co so don't know the names of them if you know then please leave me a link down below but to start with they added in this which I think is a little freebie which is really cute um 
so that is just adorable and then this which is i think they call them um oh there's a word for them i can't remember it's just gone off the top of my head wiggles that's the one is it wiggles that they call them i do watch a lot of um scribble prints co on youtube i love watching her um plan with me's and stuff so that's really cool i will find somewhere to use this uh, where are we um this one i picked up just on its own it didn't come with a kit it was just some boxes that weren't used so i will find some stickers to go with these really cute uh let's do this one first actually this one was i think like a basic kit it didn't have the full kit whereas this one here is a full kit so i have the full boxes uh the little things and some quarter boxes and some half boxes um this which has all the flags and the full box uh weekly things and the icons and stuff and then this which has the deco and some more boxes and weekend banner so again not normally the type of paper that i would go for but i am trying to build up a bit of a d stash collection of scribble prints co um so anytime i do see them on d stashes i try and pick up the ones that i like uh so that yeah really really like that kit it's a disney themed kit as well as you can see the next one is this summer um kit it says hello summer i don't know if that's the name of it oh wait i've just seen the names they're right up here in the little corner um so this one's actually called cruise let me backtrack a second because this one is called galaxy magic and this one was fiesta so that's cool i found the names <laughs> didn't realize they did the names and i don't know if this is the old format of the kits or not um i'm not really hugely clued up on scribble prints co but um yeah so this is the cruise kit super super bright and summery um i love the color theme on this with the, the greens the yellows the blues and then this like peachy pink peachy corally pink it looks a bit red in my camera i think but it's like a peachy coral and i like this one because it obviously comes with the date covers so that was the cruise kit sorry if i keep pausing i've got horrendous hiccups at the moment then this one does it have a name i don't know it doesn't appear to uh, i don't think this one has a name so um this one is like a completely full kit it actually comes with two of the add-on sheets so two lots of washi and two lots of the extra boxes so that's what they look like that's really cool um and these are the full boxes and wow some more full boxes oh wait so this one must be the add-on full box and then this one must be the actual full box with the little double box down the bottom um the little things uh the checklists and the functional page the decoration page with the deco and stuff the bottom washi and the date headers some extra boxes oh i'm not in frame extra boxes um some more of these things icons and things and some more boxes and i love the square boxes as well i have been using square boxes recently a heck of a lot um so yeah i don't actually know what this kit is called it doesn't have the name i don't know if this is like the old format or the new format um so yeah that was what i got in a d stash and reasonably priced uh, for d-stashes when you have kits that you don't use as well um and yeah so i'm super super happy that i got all of that look how thick that kiss um yeah so i'm gonna see how these go i'll obviously save them probably for summertime next year but that was my d-stash kits and things from d-stashes and i will put those away and i'm gonna go on to um i'll probably go on to the things that weren't bought in black friday um just some random things so i'm gonna grab those out take them out the bag and i'll come back okay so i've decided to do these separately rather than just pull it all out and waffle on like i did on the last one <coughs> oh excuse me right so this is um peach puddles co 
I do PR for Peach Puddles Co. Um, for the lovely Beth. And we've recently redesigned our freebies. And this is what they look like. Don't know if I have another one. I don't think I do. So um, it's like a little post-it note. It's got my little purple washi. My code at the top there which is Raina10. I'll leave it down here as well. Um, and then I have the little peepin halley. And just some kind of autumn-y themed things and the birthday things because I am an autumn baby as well so I chose to have the birthday bits um bath bombs I love having baths and as I said the autumn things so that's my freebie um I will do my order first I think so I've got some really really cool stuff in my order um I've been collecting Beth's uh die cuts as well so I have all of the die cuts so far I think um so we'll do the die cuts first actually so the die cuts are um obviously of Halley. so i will probably laminate these and then switch them in and out of my planner so that i know what time of year it is <laughs> um so this is like the summertime die cut really really cute Halley in a jar with her little sand castle um i have the birthday one so i will obviously be using this in september when it's my birthday um and they are all in jars that's kind of Beth's theme and they're all completely hand designed and hand drawn by drawn 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 by Beth <laughs> she's wonderful she's brilliant um this is the hanging the stars one which is really cute I think that was one of the first ones that came out um and then this is the autumn one which is just I think probably my favorite out of all, the, all of them because I'm an autumn baby um I then picked up a few extra sheets and I do have a album which is for Peach Puddles Co as well. Um, I won't show you but um, there will be a video again coming soon of my sticker albums and how I organise my stickers to follow on from the last reusable sticker album part of my series if you like that I'm trying to do. Um, so anyway, these stickers are number 18 and they are the birthday stickers. These ones are the No Posts on Sunday stickers. These ones are the other birthday stickers. So Hallie in a box and blowing the little party thing. Um, I'll show you these autumn ones next. So I have the Autumn Leaves Hallie, which I think was on my, yeah. So it's the same one that's on my freebie there as well. And then I have the little fox, Hallie. She is so cute as a little fox with a little star on her head. And then these two were foiled, but I got the rose gold um, drips, like uh, divider header things in the little drips, little blood drips. And then I got the no post on Sunday in rose gold as well. Um, if you don't know already, I am very much a rose gold person. That is pretty much majority of what I use in my planners is rose gold, along with the other basics being silver hollow and uh, hollow silver and um gold then i'm going to show you this which is the black friday freebie so this one is in a black friday um deal or she certainly added added them in for me so take my money <laughs> i love this i hope she does a full sheet of these um and then the shopping ones and the little checklist ones obviously for your shopping list and then shop to drop and black friday is a script this was then part of the christmas thing i need to put this on my whiteboard um and start filling it in but this is the um little santa's beard washi card and then you put the little hollow dots i think she puts the colored dots in um randomly so i got the hollow ones this time um, which is awesome. I love hollow as much as I love rose gold. And it says Santa's beard is very bare. On his chin there is no hair. Put a sticker on each December day. Then that night he will be on his way. So you basically pull the stickers off and add them to um, little Hallie's Santa beard. <laughs> and again, this was all designed by Beth. She is so talented. Um, and then I'll flick you through these just while I talk about them. But I think this was... Um, from another D stash where you get the little bits of freebies um, from all the other shops like the swap shops and stuff like that um, so I have Peach Princess which I did an order from her um, Rose Lily Plans which is on my list to order from um, Autumn Sampler from the Do It All Mum on Etsy uh, this one which is from 
Ellen B makes. I've never ordered or had from them before. I think I have another freebie like this. Um, obviously Bella Planella. She is one of my favourites and I do also PR from her. And I've also got um, an order from her that I'm going to show you shortly. Um, House of Stickers. Wow, that is such nice paper. They'll be on my order list. And then this one which is planning. Oh, Aloha planning designs. Um, which is really really cute and then this one which is crafty planning I've had a few of these um, swap freebies from them as well so that's all of those from Peach Puddles Co don't forget to use my code RAINA10 at checkout um, that's how you spell my name for anyone who wonders R-A-Y-N-E-R -E um, and I'll leave it down here somewhere as well Okay, so now it's time for, of course, Bella Planella. Um, this is two separate orders, I believe, and this was part of the Black Friday sale, so I got some Black Friday freebies, um, and then some extra bits that I wanted to pick up anyway, just to stock up. Um, and yeah, so that's that. I will go through the samplers later. Um, first, I'll go through the freebies, and then I'll go through what I actually ordered. So you always get the... Um, loyalty card I've gone through a few of these because I shop from uh, Rach pretty much every month <laughs> um, I've already got one of these so if I don't de-stash it I will maybe use it as a front and a back cover and make a little planner of some sort or a cover for something um, then we go on to the freebies itself so this is the Black Friday Facebook freebie um, so if you're on Rachel's Facebook page, which is uh, Bella Babes, you'll know that she did a post um, saying if you add this to the notes to seller, you will get this freebie. And it's a foiled um, overlay box, two foiled overlay boxes that said, I came, I shopped, I dropped. And uh, it's an add to cart kind of day. So they will be useful. Um, then I got the whole lot of the freebies because I did spend over £25 so you got the every order freebie and don't forget to collect your little icon for your loyalty card um, this is the over five, oh, £5 freebie here with some scripts and some washi I got the £15 freebie with some four boxes and bits and pieces there at the bottom and then this freebie with some more four boxes and some checklists and some other boxes so i always keep these freebies together because uh, minus this one this one goes in my freebie box um but these ones will as you can see make up a whole entire kit so i will probably just add that to it to be fair but yes yeah, so they make up a whole or part of a kit so it would have been something that rach could have made into a kit but instead she used the artwork for these tiered freebies and i always love tiered freebies and I make them into kits for myself and that makes me spend more money <laughs> so that was those um I'll go into my main order so Rachel's bought some new bits to the shop um first of all these which aren't new but I use these stickers all the time when I'm um using them for icons for planning so I picked up two sheets um and they have like little planners and planner stacks down here, printers, um, your like sticker envelopes and things like that, your little post things, your little planners. So I picked up two because I use these sheets absolutely all the time. Then I wanted to get some more bougie boxes. I think that's what they're called or what the Americans call them. Um, these are either over or underlay boxes. <coughs> Excuse me again. So I picked up the Mickey heads with the confetti in the background and I got rose gold, gold, holographic silver and silver. So is my camera going to show them? I don't know. Hopefully you can see them. When I say camera, I mean phone, by the way. I do film with a phone. Um, I'm saving up for a camera. And then this was a new thing that Rach had bought to the shops and it was a limited supply because I think she was trying to work out if they were a sellout and I did tell her that they would be a sellout and I believe she sold out. So if you didn't pick these up in your order, then why not, first of all? <laughs> um, and secondly, uh, I will try my best to convince Rach to bring them to the shop full time. But um, I think they were actually inspired by... Um, 
the sets that Scribble Prince Co does for her, is it the Wiggles, I believe that's what they're called, I think that's what I said earlier, um, and you basically get a set of foils to use as overlay foils, um, and to go with a kit, which is really, really cool. So to start with, got it in rose gold, you can only get the sets in one colour, you can't mix the colours, um, but I got it in rose gold, so I got these, which are the little emojis, which are so cute. Um, and the nice thing about these as well, before I go on, is that you don't necessarily have to use a whole lot in one week spread. You can kind of save them for the next, for, and kind of use them up in different weeks. Um, so you've got some scripts here as well, and I love this font for the scripts. And you've got some other icons, like the more functional icons, just as they are. And then you've got some more functional icons, but the circle ones, along with the numbers at the bottom which is really good, so you can use those numbers during uh, a weekly spread or during a monthly. Then you get a whole massive stash of overlay and underlay boxes. So, let me try and work out what's what. Um, I think the top row of all of these, I think it's near enough to say, the top row of all of these are... Um, where are we? Trying to work. Ah, there we go. So yeah, so you get four uh, overlay boxes. So that's the, uh, sorry, eight overlay boxes. So the bottom ones here on all of them are overlay boxes um, and they can go over your stickers, over your four boxes. And then the top left side is a four box for underlay. So you could put them over the top if you wanted, but otherwise they're a bit fuller and have a bit more of an image to them. Um, so you then layer your stickers over the top. And then the top right is your uh, washi strips. So if you wanted to go over your washi strips, just try and peel one up for you. That's what they look like. Hopefully you guys can see. There you go. Um, so you do get a massive amount of them. You get four sheets in total, which is really, really cool. And then you have one sheet of the washi overlay. Now, Rach only does one type of kit for um, her weeklies, so she can do them in different sizes, but it is um, one in terms of the washi strips. So there's none of the thick, kind of old Erin Condren style washi strips. It's all one specific thing. So that basically means that all of these will fit um, in her weekly kits. I don't quite know how I was trying to say that. It's kind of like a standard vertical type thing. Um, so that's that. So this is really cool. So you get your thicker washi and your thinner washi. And then she's also added some of these gorgeous little arrows at the end. So sorry I waffled on then. Um, I wanted to try and give you as much info as I can doing my little PR job. Um, so they were really, really good value for money. They were discounted because it was Black Friday as well. Um, and obviously if you use the, the Black Friday code, then obviously they were discounted. So love these little wiggle style stickers. Last thing I'm going to quickly flick through is again, another freebie swap that Rachel would have done. So most of these I think would be doubles depending on who she swapped with, but that's fine. I'll either de-stash them, um, when I get a chance and when I get time to do stash or I'll um, find a way to use them up so Rebel Links Co I've ordered from them before they are a fab shop and look at this freebie it's like completely foiled out so cool um Rose Lily Plans never ordered from them before but I've heard amazing things about them um, again another one from Aloha Planning Designs so I've got doubles and these are like your icons that you'd use most of the time anyway obviously for McDonald's <laughs> um lily wood designs co i have done an order from them recently i'm waiting for that to come in depending on how long this video is i may add it in here otherwise definitely keep an eye on my instagram um just because i feel like i'm not sure if haul videos is what you want to see all the time but they're great filler videos for me anyway i'm waffling on um so yeah so that's lily wood design co um peach puddles obviously i've got the black friday one already so always nice because i really 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 like this take my money um icon i i'm gonna beg beth um at peach puddles co to see if she, to see if she'll release like a full sheet of those um laura sticker co again never ordered from them heard amazing things um, who's this? Crafty Planning. Again, never ordered them. Heard really, really good things about their kits and stuff. I've got a lot of the freebies from other sales and stuff, so seem to be collecting those. 
Um, what's this one? Ooh. Oh, Busy Bee Planner Studio. Sorry, that was really small. <laughs> um, Busy Bee Planner Studio. Don't think I've heard of them before. If you have, then let me know what they're like. Um, I'm always interested in finding new shops. As you know, I used to PR for Jolly Sticks. Um, don't anymore. Unfortunately, she stopped her PR situation. Um, but this is your freebie that you get from Jolly Sticks. I think that's also her every order freebie or something similar to that. Um, this one is CG Plans. Again, don't think I've ever ordered from them. Uh, Paper Shire Stationery. I've heard amazing things about them. I've had a couple of freebies from other sales from them before. And yeah, really, really cool. Definitely on my to shop from list. Uh, this is a plan with pizzas, pizzas, Piz pizzazz, no, plan with pizzazz, um, love the fact that these are all coffee cups, <laughs> um, I'm a huge fan of Starbucks as well, so definitely gonna use those, uh, I have crafty mama mate, crafty mama makes, <laughs> that's really hard to say really fast, uh, again, love the theme of these, um, never ordered from her, but I believe, I've spoken to her before because I believe she sells stamps and things like that as well. So, and I've been really trying to do a bit of research on stamps before I buy. Um, this one is Little Pencil Design and I've never ordered from them before, but I have a very good friend in the planner community who I know PRs for them. Faith, if you're watching, hello, my dear. Um, and yeah, I definitely want to order from them. Uh, oh, I've got the uh, Ellen B Makes again. So again, heard from them, heard of them, but never ordered. And Legally Planning, once again, heard of them, but never... Oh, sorry. Legally Planning, of course I've ordered from them. Um, did I put it in a D-stash? I can't remember if I've put um, my haul from them in a D-stash or not. But yeah, so that's all those sale freebies there. Um, I have so many freebies and I'm probably going to need to go through at some point and stash some because I have rather a lot <laughs> so that was it from Bella Panella don't forget to use my code just here which is reign of 15 um, you'll get 15% off and you will also get my freebie which I will show you my freebie before I finish this clip hold on one second do I have one I don't know if I do no nope, I don't sorry I thought I had one of my freebies I've obviously used it um, so yeah, don't forget to use my code, you'll get my freebie. And uh, let's head on to the next one. Okay, so the next part of the haul is from um, Peachy Princess. I'm not going to bother going through these, um, just because I feel like a lot of them are going to be doubles anyway. Um, so I'm just going to show you what my haul is. I'll go through them later. I just don't want this video to be hugely long like I know it's about to be. Um, so... Here is Peachy Princess's little business card. Um, I do follow them on Instagram and obviously on Facebook. Um, and I ordered this stuff off Etsy. So the main part of my order is that. But freebie wise, because it was obviously Christmas, I've got this gorgeous, adorable little die cut. Oh, so cute. Um, these which are green foil. I've never come across green foil before, but it's this awesome Christmas green foil. Um, with a few different, um, what do you call it, scripts. So you've got warm and cozy, sweater weather, hot chocolate and snuggle time. So that's really, really cute. Um, I then have this, which is a freebie. Um, and it's like a bit of a kit. So again, I will put that in my kit binder and I'll find something to use it for, I guess. Really, really cute. Love that. The main part of my order was these um scalloped header things and then some other little scalloped scalloped or mandala i don't know what you call them let's say mandala mandala <laughs> um so i've got, got these in black so no foil on those got them in silver got them in a road uh, road gold holographic and look at the way that that's hollow it's like the lines going across adorable got them in gold 
I got them in rose gold, obviously. I should have got two sheets of those because I know that they're going to be the first to be used. And then we go on to these fun things. Now, I didn't actually order these in black. I don't know why. Um, please ignore the bit of ink on my finger, by the way. Just notice that at the corner of my eye. Um, so I got them in the hollow again, the rose gold, the gold, and the silver. So that's the main part of my Peachy Princess haul. Um, I don't have a code, but I think I used the Black Friday code, which at the time was give me all the free, uh, give me all the freebies, something like that. Give me freebies. That was the code. That was like across all of the stores for the Black Friday weekend, which is obviously over now. Sad times. I so could have bought some more stuff. <laughs> okay, cool. So that's Peachy Princess. Um, I'm going to pull a couple of things in. Um, this is just a very quick one, a very quick order from the Plump Planner. Um, it's a reusable sticker book. And as you already know, I have these six by four with this gorgeous cover on it. Um, but I actually got this one, which is the five by seven. So there you can see for comparison. I asked um, Karen very, very nicely if she had a spare one. Um, said I didn't mind whether it had the cover on it or not, because I can always stick something on there if I want to. Otherwise, I'll probably just leave it blank. Um, but I thought rather than buying another album, because as you guys know, I do try and keep my albums shop specific. Um, I just thought I'd have a sticker album, a uh, reusable sticker album for, um, Peach, Peach Puddles Co? Plump Planner. I meant to say Plump Planner. If I didn't say Plump Planner, I meant to say the Plump Planner. <laughs> um, so Karen at the Plump Planner very kindly sent me one of these. I did pay for it, but she said that she had a few spares that she hadn't used um, when she was selling them. She actually was selling these on her Facebook page. I don't know if they went up on her Etsy, but I know she had a very limited stock just to see how they would sell. Um, and I obviously picked up a small one, but I wanted a bigger one for my icons because I have a large basket full of uh, the Plump Planner icons and like the little scripts and things. So I thought I will spend one evening put them all into here so that's that that was just a quick one to tell you what i'd got um i will go with this one next this one is from silent beauty plans never ordered from them before um so again i did get a bunch of oh no i didn't get a bunch of freebies that's just how my stuff is packaged so that's cool Oh, a cellophane noise. I'm not a fan of it, but some people are, so I thought I'd um, give you a little bit of it. That was just my order sheet. Um, I don't think I actually got anything else in there. No, that's fine. So, from them. Oh, they're such tiny sheets. Oh, the sheets are so cool. So, I've actually got a micro sticker album with micro sticker sheets. So, I think that's probably where I will store these or I'll make myself a separate one because I know I'm definitely going to do another order with this shop because these were such good value for money and because they're such small sheets and such nice small writing you get so many on them so I did get the um this was Oh, I used a um, code. I used Rosanna's code. So thank you very much, Rosanna. Um, I used her code. And this is really cute. It's got a little, I think that's supposed to be a little slug. <laughs> but it's really adorable. Um, and then I got the, um, her, she has this gorgeous full box. So I don't know where I'm going to end up storing this, but love that. Um, and then I have this freebie, which is the November Treat 2020 freebie. So they were the freebies. And then this is the bulk of my order, which is all of these sheets here. So I will use my planner punch to punch these. Um, and I will probably make myself another little book because micro books are so cute. Um, so I got chores. And these scripts are really are tiny. You can see it compared to my nail there. They are tiny. Um, I got chores. I got meals. I got net, uh, next week, not Netflix. I got to buy. Oh, I've gone blurry. I got to buy. I got date night. I got happy mail. I got self care. To do. PR post. Plan. Just trying to make sure these are all in frame. Disney Plus, which I have got back again. <laughs> uh, Netflix. 
No, stop being blurry. Netflix, Instagram, and you guessed it, nails. Because I need to remind myself to do my nails. So, yeah, I will, uh, if I have the time, when I make my second little micro book, I may film myself punching these and making the book itself. In case that's something that you guys want to see. Please let me know down below if that is something that you want to see. Um... Oh, and then this is so cute as well. On the packaging, she had these. Love your order? Let us know. Leave us a review on Etsy, which, of course, I will leave them a review because I do always leave reviews. Um, This order was from um, this shop, which is a washi sampler shop. Um, I've, I've never really come across a shop like this, but there were some gorgeous washi. So this is uh, Callis. Calicidi plans if any of you have heard of her um she's a washi samples and custom dashboards shop so that's really cool um i got this gorgeous little handwritten note which says dear Raina, thank you so much for your order i hope you enjoy your washi best wishes from kirsty love little handwritten notes i do keep them all and then this was my order i I only got a few because I've never come across it before. But she basically makes these washi cards. And then when you look to get a, a set of the washi as a sampler, um, you get 50 centimetres or thereabouts of each type of washi. So it actually looks like quite a lot. I don't know if you guys can actually see the thickness, but it seems like quite a lot. 50 centimetres is a fair amount. <laughs> Um, so I got this set, which I don't know what it is. I don't know what it's called, um, which is, I'll show you this side actually. So it has this gorgeous rose gold effect. That is just beautiful. And especially this, which I think is supposed to be overlay tape as well, which is so cute. Um, I got this one, um, which is really, really cute. When my phone wants to focus. I don't know why it's not focusing. There we go. Right, I'll do it over here now. Um, so it's got a little bit of writing on it, which I don't mind. And then this one. When my phone wants to focus. There we go. And this one is some, like, space-themed, moon-themed type washi. So I love that. That's really, really cool. Um, I love this idea and I have got a new washi storage system over there <laughs> um, so I'll find a way to store these um, but yeah so really really cool if you are ever wondering what some of the oh and I think these are all simply gilded or of those sorts of shops um, so she actually takes them from her own collection and or you know when she buys them and then she wraps them and sells them on as samplers which I think is such a cool idea um, so yeah really really love that and then do this one quickly this was from a shop which was a new to me shop just while i'm here these were the freebies it was a shop called um oh, i can't remember oh god i actually don't know it was something Oh, oh my corgi, that was it. So I'll take it out of this. Comes in this cute little envelope. Um, I think it came from one of those type kawaii, kawaii type shops. So it was really, really gorgeously wrapped. Um, tons of like little extras and freebies and stuff. Like these are all little stickers, and you just peel them off, and they're so cute. Um, so I'm not quite sure how I'll use those, but they're really cute i'll just show you those quickly oh that one there and it's not coming up oh this is like a little corgi thing there as well so yeah that was freebies uh the shop is called oh my corgi if you've heard of it i have used this washi um but it's like this weird washi so you have to peel the back off never come across that before um and it was this gorgeous design here with the gold and like the little honeycomb shapes with the pink. Um, the main reason was because I was looking for this type of tape, which when I got it, it was uh, a bit different to what I was expecting. I'm not going to unroll them all for you, but it's uh, it came in this set. 
um, and some of them are clear and some of them are on the white background. They are just really, really thin washi um, with different designs on them. So really, really reasonably priced. Came in like two or three weeks, I think. So it definitely came from overseas and the shipping was really, really cheap. So never know. Maybe I'll pick up some more washi from them in the future. Uh, and then these were freebies as well. I think they're just like seals or something. Um, and then these came with it as well. <laughs> So, not sure if I will use these or not. Um, but yeah, so that was from Oh My Corgi. And then I'm going to unwrap my Prairie Planner order, which is my final order. Um, I don't know if I have anything else on its way. No, I don't. But yeah, let me unwrap this so you don't get the cello noise. Okay, so Plump Planner. Uh, I am getting my words mixed up today. I'm so sorry. The Prairie Planner. Um, I've recently joined her Facebook group, which is really, really cool. Everyone is so welcoming. Um, this is probably one of the only shops that I shop from that is overseas, aside from this new Oh My Corgi shop. But I have ordered from them, as you know, quite a few times. Absolutely love the um, designs and the formats of the kits and all sorts of stuff. So there's quite a lot that I've got to talk about in this one. So, um, let me organise it first of all. I'll show you the freebies. So, obviously, I got the all the time freebie, like the every every month freebie. This does change on a monthly basis. And then I used Daniela's freebie this time, or Daniela's code this time, to get her freebie. Um, what I actually did, I actually screenshotted all of the freebies for the month of November um, when they were available I think it was November or it might have been the December ones um just so that I know that I try and use all of their freebies <laughs> um because they're all so different and they're all so lovely so yep and then you always get a loyalty card now then um I'm gonna organize these into piles I've got quite a few of the different things this time Okay, so let's do these first. These are the Prairie Girls, um, and they're in th um, the girl, which is called Vivian. So she's a darker skin girl with black hair. Um, so these are the Me Time icons. So they're very, very similar, actually, to the Bella Planella um, characters that I got, um, which I like because two of my favourite shops, and they have very similar, um, but slightly different, I suppose, um, characters. And character stickers aren't things that I use all the time, so I'm trying to elaborate on what I actually use and kind of use more character stickers. That's my goal for 2021, use more character stickers. So anyway, I got the Me Time ones, the Winter ones, which are so cute, the little snow angel. I can hold these up a bit more. Um, I've got the Christmas Vivians, so putting up the Christmas tree and opening the stocking. Um, making the gingerbread men and things like that so yeah super cute I've got the planning ones um, so these are adorable the little planner spreads and the planner doing <laughs> um, these are the yoga ones again just so cute and I love that she's got a little ponytail um, movie night ones I watch movies most nights and then the cook ones so yeah that's another goal of mine for 2021 um is to cook more and to use character stickers more and uh, lots of other things as well i want to know what some of your um resolutions if it's that time yet some of your new year's resolutions let me know um i'm trying to see if i can find these because Okay, let's do these sheets next. So this is quite a large order. What well, definitely wasn't two orders. I definitely ordered all of this in one. Um, yeah, and then I've got some kits there as well. So these ones are some more icons. I got the wash car icons, the Netflix TV icons, the cleaning icons in like a complete rainbow. This is so satisfying. <laughs> Um, the bath time ones with the different colour bath bombs and things. Laundry day. Disney TV. Obviously, I've got Disney Plus. And then date night ones. I have been eyeing these up forever. 
and I don't mark date night enough and me and my other half we do date nights a lot we do a lot of at home date nights so I love the whole at home date night vibe right so I'm gonna sort these out now because I've got a couple of kits um they are the uh tiny kits I think they're called the tiny kit yeah so I get the tiny kits because I feel like the deluxe kit is just a little bit too much for what I actually use when I plan. This is the reflection kit. Now, if you are a Disney lover, you will know exactly what film this is. This is a Mulan film. Um, it really is adorable. I would love to know where this artwork is. <laughs> I want everything in this artwork. It is so cute. The little dragon, the little cricket. Um, obviously Mulan cutting her hair and things like that. You get a double page box, a uh, double, double box there as well. And this is the washi that comes with it. And like just the washi alone is just gorgeous. So yeah, that's the reflection boxes. Comes with the half boxes, quarter boxes and flags. Comes with the bottom washi, date covers and some functional bits there and then you get some more functionals and some icons that kind of go with the kit's colour theme and some um, scripts, weekend banner, just kind of the works and you know what, although this is the cheaper version of the kit there is obviously like the ultimate version where you get even more this literally does me for a whole week and I always end up with extra so like it's so reasonably priced and i'm telling you the shipping is around four pounds which i think is fairly reasonable so then the next kit is the relax kit let me get this one here um this is the relax kit so there's the glitter washi which is an add-on by the way i do add these on um the four boxes and this is so cute so i obviously got it in a dark skin tone but I think just the whole FaceTiming thing and like being on the sofa and just all of this sort of stuff is so lovely to see kits like this because it reminds me of when I moved in and things like that and yes I was um we were in lockdown when we moved into this house you were still allowed to move house when you were in the first swing of lockdown so yeah I think I'll probably use this kit to mark a year of when I of since like since when I moved in this property. So this time, no, August time next year or July time next year, I think is when I'll use this kit. So nostalgic, so cute. Um, so you get your half boxes, quarter boxes, things like that. Bottom washi, um, and your functional bits here and some extra things there. Um, and then your functional page. So this one didn't actually come with too many scripts, which I don't mind because I have a lot of um, scripts anyway. But I will end up doing another order of scripts because I love this font. Um, so that kit is so cute. I really, really like it. Um, just gorgeous. Just gorgeous. And before I put this lot away, I will be posting on the Facebook page with my haul just to, you know show that I did an order and yes it's possible to order from this shop even though you're not in the UK that is a kit for later this one um I don't remember ordering two lots of the glitter heads maybe I need to check back on my order or if one of them was maybe an oops I'm not sure um possibly she may have added in another one if this one was an oops or something so two glitter headers this is for cocoa bar gorgeous Christmas kit I have already planned out all my Christmas kits but never too early to order Christmas kits for next year right um so cocoa bar gorgeous this one doesn't have a double box which I don't mind um but it's absolutely gorgeous so I love that and I love like the, the whole theme of it just being Christmassy just lovely um got the half boxes quarter boxes things like that and date covers bottom washi which is this gorgeous reindeer washi and then the last page being all the functionals and the icons and stuff and again I think the only reason why I ever started ordering kits was because they always just coordinate and you can if you're not using kits I when I found or I always found when I wasn't using kits that they never matched things just never coordinated and it really did my OCD in so finally this kit wasn't a purchase it was a freebie because i had used up one of my um loyalty cards 
and so when you do you basically send a photo um, to the Prairie Planner on Etsy and you get to choose which mini kit you want as your freebie so I chose the neutral one one that's off my to, uh, to buy list because I love these kind of more functional kits and these are what I'll probably use in my social media planner um I'll show you what my planners look like for next year at some point but yes that's what I'll probably use in my social media planner um just because they're a bit more functional and they still look cute so that is pretty much it um for this entire Cool. And now I'm going to go ahead and sort out all of this and put it all away and do my other social media posts before I put it all away and make a huge mess on my desk before I go and find some things to do or some other things to do. Um, so thank you so, so much for watching. Um, I am going to finish here because I'm going to go and eat my dinner. It's, oh, it's really late. It's, 10 o'clock so I probably won't have dinner I'm probably over hungry now <laughs> um that's the life of a work by day film by night person unfortunately um but yeah thank you so so much for watching really appreciate all the comments and things that I've been getting on my videos recently it's so so nice and I will be trying to film and upload a bit more thankfully work has been a little bit quiet recently so I've been able to do filming in the evenings and actually editing and scheduling the uploads um but yeah i'm literally so so overwhelmed with um the comments and the, even just the subscribers i know i've not got many but guys it really does mean a lot you know when you have a goal in what you want to do and you feel like you're actually achieving it so yeah thank you guys so much and i will speak to you all soon and have a, a lovely rest of whatever you're doing if it's the morning have a great day if it's the evening have a lovely rest of your evening um and i will see you in the next video don't forget to like comment and subscribe as always let me know what you want to see in the up and coming videos i've got a great schedule coming up so i can't wait to film some more for you guys um and yeah thank you so much for watching see you later bye